Number 10, Ubuntu. The philosophy of interconnectedness. Ubuntu is a Bantu word meaning, I am because we are. It emphasizes the interconnectedness of humanity and the importance of compassion, empathy, and community. The lesson here is that our actions and well-being are intertwined with those around us, and we should strive to build harmonious relationships. Number 9, Mayat. The principle of balance and harmony. Mayat, an ancient Egyptian concept, represents the balance and order of the universe. It teaches us the importance of living in harmony with ourselves, others, and the natural world. The lesson is to seek balance in all aspects of life, fostering justice, truth, and moral integrity. Number 8. Sankofa. Learning from the past. Sankofa, a concept from the Akan people of Ghana, emphasizes the importance of learning from the past to shape a better future. It encourages us to reflect on history, embrace our cultural heritage, and draw wisdom from our ancestors. The lesson is to appreciate the lessons of the past and use them as a guide for personal growth and societal progress. Number 7. Sariti. The power of truth. Sariti, a Sotho slash Tswana concept, highlights the value of truthfulness and honesty. It teaches us that integrity and authenticity are crucial for personal and societal development. The lesson is to embrace truthfulness, both in our words and actions, fostering trust and fostering healthy relationships. Number 6. Motenai. Respect for resources. Motenai, a Japanese term with origins in African philosophy, promotes the mindful and respectful use of resources. It encourages us to avoid waste and to appreciate the value and interconnectedness of all things. The lesson is to cultivate a sense of stewardship for the earth and its resources, practicing sustainability and responsible consumption. Number 5. Odu Ifa. The Wisdom of Divination. Odu Ifa, a system of divination from the Yoruba people of Nigeria, provides guidance and insight into life's challenges. It emphasizes the importance of introspection, self-reflection, and seeking wisdom from elders. The lesson is to embrace introspection, learn from experiences, and seek guidance when facing difficult decisions. Number 4. Ujama, Cooperative Economics. Ujama, a Swahili word, represents the concept of collective economics and community development. It promotes the idea of sharing resources, supporting local businesses, and uplifting the community as a whole. The lesson is to recognize the power of economic cooperation, supporting one another's success, and promoting communal prosperity. Number 3. Kujikagulia, Self-Determination. Kujikagulia, a Swahili term, signifies self-determination and self-empowerment. It encourages individuals to define themselves, shape their destiny, and resist oppressive forces. The lesson is to embrace personal agency, take ownership of one's life, and strive for self-improvement. Number 2. Ayopel. Good character. Ayopel. A Yoruba phrase emphasizes the importance of good character and moral behavior. It teaches us to act with integrity, kindness, and respect towards others. The lesson is to cultivate virtues such as honesty, humility, and empathy, as they form the foundation for a meaningful and fulfilling life. Number 1. Harambi. Unity and collaboration. Harambi, a Swahili term meaning pulling together, encourages collective effort and collaboration for the betterment of the community. It highlights the power of unity and demonstrates that together we can achieve more than we can alone. The lesson is to value cooperation, embrace diversity, and work together towards common goals. These ancient African philosophical teachings offer profound life lessons, reminding us of the importance of interconnectedness, balance, truth, learning from the past, respect, self-determination, good character, unity, and collaboration. Incorporating these principles into our lives can lead to personal growth, positive relationships, and a more harmonious society.